located in our hotel Atlantis. If you stop at Atlantis, uh, you get the access to this park free. If not, you're gonna pay. Um, get a little wristband. It's awesome, man. It's such a good warm park. We're just gonna have a fun day, have a good laugh, and uh, enjoy, enjoy things. Right, she's over there, but she doesn't want to be on camera. Fair enough. I don't see why not. This bit's really cool. There's a big, big waterfall down here. Oh, mate. Oh, <laughs> Crazy man, crazy. Woo. Whoa! If you go across this wall, you're halfway around, the waves are like up to where these rocks are. Really big man. So once you're in the second tunnel, get up this wall. It's crazy. Let's catch the next wave. Show you where high we go. Airtime machine. Here it is, here it is. <laughs> it's good fun, man. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Here it is. I was going to show you, there's Torrent River that way, River Rapids that way. This is what they call these rapids, and there's two different types of routes, and then it kind of branches off in multiple paths. Kind of acts like a bit of a hub as well because a lot of the slides end up in the rapids. So you want you go on a slide the other side of the park and you end up down here. Crazy. I'll so, uh, show you a bit of this. So chilled. Well, it was chilled. Rapids. Now it's nice and gentle again. Bye Rachel. This looks mad. Here we go. Oh no! Oh no! Created my own swimming pool and my own little my own little boat. Happy days. Pool within a pool. Inception. Actually. Pool within a pool. Swimception. You got these nice, calm, gentle, chilled out moments, and all of a sudden you got. Having my own little personal paddling for. It's good fun. Ready? Ready? Oh. <laughs> Ooh. You have no idea how hot this floor is right now. <laughs> the trouble is, like, some slides, because they bring you out into the rapids, you leave your shoes by the slides, and ah! You can take your shoes with you, but it's awkward because you've got to carry them on the slides, on your arms, like this, and it's just... I'd rather not. It's just uncomfortable, but then again, I'm going to have to burn my feet to get back to them. So I'm just down here, we've got the shark slide, which takes you through the shark tank, uh, which is going to do that. And then... Uh, ah, ah, oh my god, sort of platform of shadow here, there we go, lovely. <laughs> Good stuff. Woo. Whoa, what are that <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh, <yeah. 
Just on to the swarm. Now, a tip for this one, it's really hidden away, so don't miss it out. It's like, there's two slides to this one. There's one which is a bit more intense, then one a bit more like, you, you milk it in a tube, so it's a bit more forceful, you go around helixes and stuff. Um, to get to it, you gotta go halfway around the entire rapids, and there's a little cut off. It's not very uh, side posted. I don't think there is any science. They so just wander off through this cut off, walk, you trek a bit and then you, you end up here where the slide is and you're like oh it's a slide there is another way like a shortcut uh, just by just beyond the tower of poseidon so if you go around the right hand side of it you'll get to it um near at the top now going up the conveyor belt it's pretty high up actually it's going on for a while <laughs> right let's check this out hello Sadly, the second half, which is, I think it was the plunge, oh, I can't remember, it was closed off, so we've gone to the top of the tower, not to leap of faith, not here, that's, that's too scary, man. But there's, a, there's another big slide, we use one of these, and there uh, are lots of little air tunnels and stuff, so we'll find out what that's like. Oh, mate. Oh, my God. Whoa! and ended up in the rapids. That's crazy, man. Here we are. Oh, this looks familiar. Awesome. Stuck in a bit of congestion, I think. Oh, 
I've got no nails. I'm all wrinkly. Screw loop pro tip, keep hydrated because it's like 40 degrees and you don't want to be dying in the middle of a walk park. It's the last thing you want to do. So. This place is so big that you've got zip lines that can take you from one, one slide or one section of the park to the other. And also, if you're walking on this path, um, we did two on good pass, but we forgot to hire him down. You can actually jump on the yeah, the little caddies. It'll take you from one end of the park to the other. <sighs> Knackered. It's opening in summer 2020, so there's more slide complex. And you've got the other hotel, which is just up here. You probably can't pick it up very well on the uh, the GoPro. But that should be opening next year in 2020, so do look out for that. That is a beast of a half pipe right there. Man. Imagine coming up that like a BMX or something, that's crazy. Now this is the true half pipe. Look at the size of this. Into a beast. You got these body slides as well. They come down here, you come down at quite some speed apparently, so we might give them a go. Uh Aquacondor, Zimmeranga. Yeah. That is steep. Oh my god. <laughs> Why do we always have to go backwards? <laughs> oh! We're gonna go on these now, the tube slide, so slithering, Poseidon's Revenge. I know ones I could drop one, but I'm definitely not doing that just yet. I'm scared of body slides, I just hate my back being battered, man. I'd rather be on a boat, I feel so much safer. But yeah, let's do this. I'm actually petrified of how much this. Feeling a bit apprehensive about this one, you know. Oh my god. Hold me back. Hold <laughs> me back. <laughs> Back. That kills, man. Oh. I did not like that one. Honestly, thought like I was gonna drown halfway through. <laughs> I was like, literally, all the nose, everything. My back is in pieces. I was actually contemplating doing the Poseidon's one, but I might have to. I have to leave that. I'll cool, I'll cool coat with my back being cut to pieces again. This is what I don't like: body slides. Prayer. I prefer the ones with boats. I don't know if it's more skin or what, but I just I seem to get like you know really sore after one of them. So I'm gonna check out this side of the rapids now, see if we can get on there. Oh, oh wow, that kind of takes you by surprise, though. Huh? One more time, yeah. Come on. Uh, this is one of those like, you know, well it's not really a ride, it's a rapid. It's one of those where you go, you do a lap and then you're like, just one more time, let's do it again. Man, I love it. This is the life. 
sun blazing just a rubber dinghy and a load of rapids bro so let's go again you know i absolutely love the slides and that but nothing beats this honestly like, the slides are good put them over within seconds this you can just chill wander off wherever you want to go let your mind wander there's many routes you can go many places you can endeavor for me torrent river just hitting those waves up and down my head like, lent against this catching a tan this is nice man i love it anything better now is to have a beer there and a nice steak but it might be a bit weird in the rapids you gotta watch you don't get down that way because it takes you on the really long rapids so if you want to go around for about half an hour 45 minutes and go ahead but oh, i like this one it's like five minutes long it does the same old thing it actually moves because that's quite it's not as rapid but it has the moments so you kind of go down the little slopes which are really cool as well but uh oh it is man waves i like waves and that, that's confusing that's that's is the storms aqua express i think that's like the fast track way to get there but to actually get there you've got to go through the rapids and come in from the rapids that way it's really weird don't even ask me how to get to the storm i, I don't even know myself it's very confusing oh my god Woo! <laughs> i'm at the whirlpool so after a nice splashy time in the Aquaventure uh, water park, just by the beach now, chilling. And then we're gonna go check out the uh, the Aqua Check with the uh, there's like about 12 different types of sharks. You go in and chill with them. And then we're gonna also dine with the sharks at the Oceana. So uh, keep watching, stay tuned for that. But first, Aqua Trek.
cocktail, but this is awesome. It's like, I don't know what that is, so something caramelised. Yeah. You gonna try your pearl? No, not going That's so cool. Look at that table right by our mates. Oh, wow. Just a little palate cleanser ah. <laughs> um, on your plate. Uh, uh, it's an infuse of white house tea and cranberry juice and surface is chilled, right? So don't try to bite it and don't try to cut it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let's try this. Let's expect to see what happens. That's actually really nice. First time trying caviar, let's see what this is like then. Um, and salmon. It's meant to be smoky, so I feel like it's gonna go everywhere. Right? It's actually nice. It's like... Very smoky. He blocked my way at the ladder earlier. So here we got stage one. I think it's some kind of cheese based thing. He, he did explain it. Oh, I forgot already. It looks nice. There's some tomatoes, cheese, that, and then uh, sauce. Enjoy. I've tried tomato before. Yeah, but I've never seen you eat tomato in my life, so. <laughs> Is that? That's nice, isn't it? Oh, really nice, so I've got a bit left, I'm gonna dig in. So. so this is a toilet in Oceano, you get your own private cubicle, private toilet to poo, and you've got your, your thing that washes your bum. Two toilet rolls, magazines, this beautiful looking sink, towels, a mirror, that look amazing, and even more tissue, just for the sake of it. What the hell? Okay, this is stage two, and it's coming a cloud. Oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> this looks good. So I went for the Cosmosphere, which is really nice, super strong. It's got a big cranberry iceberg in the middle. It's quite nice. Yeah, very strong. This one. What did you have? Lady Lena. Lady Lena. That is one of the nicest cocktails I've ever tried in my life. It's so nice. So here's stage three, we're not eating off a plate, but we're eating off a clock and it's going backwards. That's so cool. Let's see what this is going to be like. There's truffle. Never, well, tried truffle before, but never tried it in that size. That's going to be interesting. That was the best so far, what do you reckon? I've never eaten off a clock, never eaten black truffle. And I can say both are amazing. Especially enough for clock that's going backwards. Here we are, stage four. It's some some kind of soup. We've got radish. It's artichoke soup, radish, and there's uh, another bit of. Uh, yeah, I'm no good with this. Let's try this. So this is the palate cleanser. I don't know much about it. I've completely forgot. But I know there's 24 karat gold right there. With a carrot and ginger base, and 24 karat gold. Lemon, lemon so. foam with a carrot and ginger base, and then 24 carat gold on top. I have no idea what to expect. Right, let's try this then. I've never tried gold in my life, so it's gonna be weird. Well, ooh, quite lemony. Eh? <laughs> Ice off the foam. That was the nicest palate cleanser I've ever tried in my life. What do you think about that? So, uh, very lemony, very nice. So we're on stage five now, we've got chicken. It's actually cooked on the barbecue, as was there, wrapped in banana leaves, which is really nice. Comes with olives, and then we've got, there was a kebab. Oh, I've liver. already forgot, you, you tell me. Chicken liver. <coughs> Butter. <laughs> You're just summit. as bad as me. <laughs> Butter summit. It was summit that I can't pronounce because it was in a different language. That. That's something to do with the uh, chicken, chicken liver. And then we've got these sauces here. Let's try it. Let's go. And it's, yeah, we've got. She's got a unique knife, and I've got a unique knife. Because I'm clumsy. 
Yeah, so between women and men, we have our own noise. Let's do this. That was very nice. Very nice. How's yours? Man, I love that sauce. Nice. <laughs> oh, wow. <Get> to move. <laughs> so at first we will take all the salt, all of it, please. We will leave it uh, for two or three seconds on the on the tongue. Yeah. We will taste. Then we will cheer and we will drink. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, I forgot that was there. Cheers. <laughs> oh, Australia. It's cold. <laughs> mm. <laughs> That's nice. Wow. Oh, that was lovely. Serves as a palate cleanser. I hope you put this in. Thank that you. brilliant. That was a palate cleanser. <laughs> <laughs> Final stage is actually a complete oh. surprise. It's life starts at the end of your comfort zone. So I have no idea what this is. This looks really interesting. I think we should blow it together. We've got a nice little final bonus stage. Happy honeymoon. <laughs> I just want to say a massive thanks to Oceano and everyone around us who's helped us. It's been very nice because it's been a very nice meal. So, should we do it together? Yeah. Wait, three, two, one. Ah, oh, <laughs> delayed reaction then. Okay, then the after credits bonus stage now. We've got the bill, but with the bill, we've got an extra course. That was a very nice meal, was this? It's quite filling considering it's like, you know, you get lots of more. Oh, amazing. Thank you so much Unbelievable. You. Thank you. So, yeah. Yeah. So, it's, you know, it's quite filling considering you get like seven courses and quite small portions, but they yeah, I'm feeling very filling. 12 courses in the end. Yeah, honestly. <laughs> unbelievable. Best meal I've ever had. I mean, not, you know. You might not like everything, but at the end of the day, it's an experience. And uh, I, I said to you earlier, so it's kind of like a spiritual experience. It's really strange. I've never been to anything like that before in my life. Every meal kind of tells a story, if that makes sense. Like the way it comes around, it'll tell you exactly where it's uh, where the idea comes from. And, man, it's good. It's nice. So, yeah, I'm going to get to bed now and stuff. <laughs>